The Norwegian government has once again tightened its coronavirus measures to try and combat a rapid rise in daily positive tests for COVID-19. Gatherings in private houses are now limited to just five guests, while the maximum capacity at private events is also reduced. The government also recommends less socializing and removes some of the quarantine exemptions previously in place for business travelers. The new measures aim to target situations in which the government believes infections occur. They will last until early December, but could be extended. By that time, I hope the infection level will go down so that we can celebrate Christmas as we usually do," said Solberg at the press conference announcing the measures. Hours after the announcement, Norway's health authority revealed the highest daily total of positive test results recorded so far. The 433 new infections brings Norway's total number to 18,341. However, while both the infection numbers and those hospitalized have increased substantially in the last month, the number of deaths remains relatively low. Of the 279 deaths recorded so far, only 15 have occurred since mid-August. In private homes including gardens and cabins, there should be no more than five guests from outside the household. If all guests are from one household, there can be extra guests. Private gatherings in a public place or rented space will be limited to 50 people, down from 200. The limit of 600 people at outdoor public events is now only applicable when there is fixed seating available, such as in a soccer stadium. In addition, the government press release recommended limiting social interaction, we recommend being with fewer people in social contexts, for a shorter time, and not with many too many different people during the course of a week. Solberg said this was a critical time in the development of the virus within Norway, a sentiment echoed by Health Minister Bent Hoy. Unfortunately, we must be prepared for the fact that there will be more hospitalized with COVID-19 in the future, and there will be more who fall seriously ill. We must introduce new measures to reverse this development. There are also new restrictions imposed on business travelers from October 31st. Those arriving in the country from at-risk countries defined as red by the EU will no longer be exempt from the mandatory quarantine period. Industry employer group Norsk Industry argued that this will make the present situation more demanding for Norwegian companies. While some changes were expected, the organization's director of industrial policy Knut Sunda told VG that many companies already had comprehensive infection control procedures that went beyond the required minimum level. Additional measures have been introduced by local authorities in Oslo and Bergen, Norway's two biggest cities. Face masks are recommended on public transit when a distance of at least one meter between passengers cannot be achieved.